everyone, I'm Aisha and I'm Anmol and we're here to talk to you about the comfort king of pants, Palazzo's. We always get so many comments on how to style tops with Palazzo's, whether to go for crop tops or long kurtas or mid-length tops. And that's exactly why we're here, to share some of our personal style tips with you and the kind of tops that we love to wear with Palazzo's. So let's get started. My staple with a good pair of palazzo pants is a crop top. I always opt for one whenever I'm confused about what to wear. I feel that the length of it paired with high waist pants gives me a much sleeker look. The little gap between the crop top and the pants makes me look a bit taller which is always a bonus point. Most of the bottoms that I find are tight for me at the hips and results in a waist gap which doesn't look good at all with crop tops. I always pick pants with an elastic so that it doesn't look sloppy or loose with anything short. I wonder what Aisha's staple is. I actually face the exact opposite problem when it comes to palazzos. I have a pretty lean frame, so I feel like most pairs don't really flatter me or do much for my silhouette, which is why I love experimenting with prints and patterns, because I feel like they add a little more interest and add volume to my bottom half as well. Since I want my palazzos to be the center of attention, I tend to pick more basic t-shirts and shorts as my tops. I feel like this really works great for casual work looks or for brunch as well. So let's see what Anmol thinks about prints with palazzos. I think prints are great too. I have a slight stomach bulge, especially on bloated days. So prints help me camouflage that. But when it comes to the top, my best bet to hide any bulk is definitely layering. It adds a stylish yet comfy touch to the whole outfit. If I feel like going down the Indian route, a short kurta is what I always pick. Ethnic wear is always a problem solver. Although I prefer long straight kurtas over short ones because I feel like they make me look taller, cover up any camel toes and fix any bad fit issues without much effort. Speaking of camel toes, if you're petite like me and it's stopping you from wearing chic crop tops, opt for palazzos with more volume at the hips and waist. I always pick fabrics that won't cling to my skin like cotton, linen or rayon because they give me the best fit. Every time I'm getting dressed, whether it's to go out or just to go to work, I'm always stressed out about looking stylish and still feeling comfortable. Me too, but I think palazzos have always rescued me from these concerns and issues and I think it's safe to say that palazzos are my go-tos. So that's it from us and we hope you found our tips helpful and we answered all your questions on how to style tops with palazzo pants. Let us know if you guys want us to make more videos like this and until next time, stay tuned and stay glamorous.